Yo, what is up everyone and welcome back to another YouTube video with your host Ken Kuken and today we got Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle Ultimate Clash number something something on global. Um This is <laughs> I got killed by Jiren, so <laughs> long story short, I had to revise my int team because I was trying to do uh where the heck is Bardock real quick? I was trying to do something different. Well, I was trying to use some of the new units, right? So, and essentially, I got super attacked with my extreme int team. Uh, oh, I meant to I meant to switch up my extreme int team a little bit. Oh, well, I got super attacked with my extreme int team, and they died. And then I got super attacked with. Um, well, they died like a turn later, right? And then I got super attacked on my super int team for like the first the first time. And uh, they were like practically dead. Like the next turn was, it was, you know, I had a, it was do or die already. And I was just like, dang, if I was a little bit more luckier on my rotation. Um, so I went ahead and revised my int team. And when we get there for my super int team, when we get there, I'll, I'll explain what I did. But here we go. We're going to go through with uh, Team Bardock. Team Bardock's a good free to play team. Usually good in Ultimate Clash, just to take out the first guy right away we took a lot of damage already though that's uh in insane and unfortunate all at the same time uh these bardocks are gonna clean this up though do 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 so did anyone go out there and summon on the Goku and Vegeta banner, uh, the dual Dokkan Fest? Did you get lucky? Did you enjoy it? Uh, what happened? How did you do? So on and so forth. This is still not dead. All right, Shugash, tell me what your tanking skills are all about. Tank, tank, attack. Attack! One of these guys raises defense, right? Is it Shugash? Probably, probably is. Oh, his super tech sealed. Oh, wow. Okay, cool. Oh, we got to go right back through this. I'm not looking forward to the Bobbity. I think I'll pause the video when I go fight Bobbity, maybe. Mm, maybe not. Who's supposed to fight? What team fights Bobbity? Oh, my extreme AGL team. Which I should have I should have re revised. All right, attack extreme. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, this guy should be a piece of cake. Yeah, there's. I, I might just pause the video when I get to Bobbity and just skip him because it's just me doing a bunch of attacks. I'll show off my team. I'll go in. We'll do a couple of rounds and I'll pause it and skip him. Um, who sealed? Ah, so. All right, let's do this. Then get some key ready for the next rotation. We're gonna have both freezes together. That's gonna be pretty good. Come on, Broly, get a crit. Dang, he didn't get a crit, but he hits so hard. 2.2 million. People are like, Broly sucks. Not if he doesn't get hit, he doesn't. <laughs> just, just don't let him take a hit and he will be fine. I love that Broly, man. He can't, he can't be used in hard hitting events, but uh, I like him nonetheless. All right, Tank Frieza is sealed. We're gonna do that. We're gonna do this, and we're going to do this. That makes sure that'll make sure I have four key for someone next turn. Hopefully, we'll hopefully someone will be able to super attack next turn. Unless this Frieza ends it right here. Ooh, love my transforming Frieza. 
All right, that wasn't too bad. Level one clear, yay. Hello, come on. All right, level two. We're gonna start with this guy, my extreme strength team. Uh, leader, leader, boom, 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 boom. Um. Yeah, when I was filling this team, I put the wrong. I was filling the team with the wrong category, so I kind of messed up. All right, we're gonna have Cooler go first. Demon King Piccolo go second, which is pretty good for. He gets a hundred percent defense, and then two hundred percent attack for like the first five turns, and he gets I think plus four key with that 200 percent attack for the first five turns and then after that it's plus two key and 120 percent attack so a very solid unit i don't remember where you summon him from if it's from the um tournament banners or the world tournament banners or somewhere else but i do like getting me copies of him and his super attack is pretty dang cool uh scr janema is just scr janema he all right for a mono type leader does some decent damage tanks some decent damage and can dodge and we got lr mecha frieza and king cole wow who do i want to have super attack the most oh good we're gonna get plenty of super attack with everybody that's what i like to see uh kind of sucks no matter which way i pull this so we'll pull here you know what, I actually should have should have grabbed the uh, physical orbs. That'll, that would have made everything drop a little bit nicer for the next turn. This super attack animation is so cool. I think I'm going to rainbow these units. I think eventually I'm going to rainbow those two. And they're going to be uh, a main unit I use as often as possible. LR full power Frieza. I'll leave a link in the description below for my summons for the dual Dokkan Fest, Majin Vegeta, and Super Saiyan 3 Goku. I had a lot of luck. I only had to go... Well, I ended up buying some of the stuff from the Pilaf Trove, and that was like, I spent like $90 USD, uh, and I didn't even get everything. I got, I left like one of the premium tickets for Goku and Vegeta's banner, and I only bought one because it was like 32 bucks a pop for a guaranteed feature unit on a 10 summon multi-summon. I was not happy about that. Um, I just, I thought that was not good enough because not only that, uh, you had to um you had to buy everything before that. You had to buy level one, two before you get to the premium level three, and level one and two were just regular ticket summons. So it was like another twenty bucks per thing just to get and I'm just like, oh heck no, man. Like nah, I, I'm not about that life. Acting like I'm rich. I ain't rich, Dokon. Alright, what kind of what are we doing? We're gonna go ahead and let Kid Boo just get off rotation. Maybe not, because he was a support unit, and I don't want him to take damage. But after this turn, Golden Frieza won't need a support unit. He's gonna he's gonna massively raise his defense as he gets hit. His defense raises, I think, or he uh, the passive where he reduces damage received raises per attack taken. I don't remember. I just like him. It's free to play unit. Comes in the Dragon Ball Z, a Dragon Ball Super Broly movie event story event. Solid unit. Anywhere you could use him, especially in Clash, he's just, once he takes a hit or two, he's, he's just going to really be the defensive tank of your team. The free-to-play Androids from Android 13s, I believe it was. Um, that Broly's self-sufficient. He he always has super attack. He, <laughs> no matter what, he's just plus six key, boom, done. Like, moving on. Uh, it's wild. I guess we'll do that, and then we'll do this. Um, cooler, Final Form Cooler, I really enjoy, and then we'll grab these. Uh, he's a solid unit, not great, not horrible. He does have a chance to super attack with an additional attack. Um, the Goku Black is a decent unit. The more key spheres you give him, the stronger he's going to get attack and defensive wise. Um, not bad. And then, one, like I said, once again, Broly, self-sufficient in Ultimate Clash. He's probably just going to come on out and kill anything he comes across. I don't have a really good leader. I just have the one twenty percent leaders with for my physical team, uh, for my extreme physical team. So it could be better, but it's not. Goku, like I have no 
Aw, uh, no super attack in Goku Black. Deborah coming in clutch. Let's go. And he raises defense, so we're going to see. Oh, he's going to kill him anyway. It doesn't matter. Unbelievably sad I am. It feels like I lost a brother. Um, and I think uh, it mirrors kind of what's going on in the city and many parts of the world. He played. He was a young man with the sheer determination to play his way and see people talk. I have no idea what that was about. I'm just playing some of my buddy's music from his uh, SoundCloud Percy Notes. I'll leave a link in the description below. Uh, it's just I'm playing one of his albums, so you know I'm sure that was just like a uh, I forgot a little skit or something, or less than a skit. I'm not sure what it was. All right, this is yeah. So here's my team, poorly built. I should have built a better team because I wanted to show off Yamu and Spupovich, but they have the super attack to be better. So I'm just gonna put these units in here. Cells, uh, cell juniors are good. Babies good. Like this team. This team can link up okay together with certain, you know, rotations, but... Ah... Yeah, everyone gets sealed, so it's just a slog fest. Um... Keep the people that are doing the most damage out here. Those two link up really well. I don't even care. Just, just go. Here we go. It's been so long since I played Dokkan and, you know, it's, this is like where in the beginning of Dokkan Battlefield, you had to struggle to get super attacks off, like struggle to get them off. And now it's just, boom, you just can't get them off. And it's just, the feeling's not the same where it was, wow, I got a super attack off. Now it's like, man, if you really slowing down the game like that. <laughs> All right. Who's got the most attack? All right. And he's gonna reduce damage taken um oh well i guess we're gonna do it like this or we won't get well, we can't get a super attack off that's right Ugh, i'm already forgetting am i gonna pause it what are we at we're at 12 minutes yeah i feel like this is just gonna drain into the minutes i'm gonna go ahead and pause it and we'll be back right after this fight after i slog through like another 20 turns Yo, and we are back. And just to show you, I'm like on the last six attacks. So uh, I finished it. If I wouldn't have killed Bobby and had to go to the next round and still didn't kill him, I lost because I ran out of turns. How embarrassing would have, <laughs> how embarrassing would that have been? But we finished it. Yay, finally. All right. Whoops, I accidentally skipped the song. Oh, well. Next song. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see. Boo, we're gonna, wait. All right, we're gonna do Topo. Um, Tech, Super. Let's see, Leader, Leader. Bring, 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 bring. All right, we're gonna bring uh, all of these units in. Pretty solid against Topo. Once they get some of the, once some of these units get their defense started, they're not going to take uh, much damage. And we have Tapion for the key sphere changing. Put those two together, they'll link up. And we'll go ahead and do that. Lots of rainbow key spheres. Do 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 do. Right, the Gobros are going to be around the corner. Trunks should transform at that point in time, and we should have we should be able to link them up quite nicely. Oh my God, 122 damage i forgot some of these guys don't have super attack in them and i think if you don't have like super attack level 10 against topo or something like that you do like ridiculously low damage wow i'm almost gonna die like right off the bat topo don't do this to me don't make me do this again gracious uh I mean, I'm going to do, I'm going to do this because I'm going to need Oob to come out and transform and heal us probably is what it's looking like. And then Gobros is going to come out and get that. Um, Vegeta should do a chunk of damage here. He's probably going to take maybe two bars. Uh, if I'm lucky, he'll crit. Unfortunately, we won't get, we will never get to see Vegeta or Goku transform in these events. 
in the ultimate clash because the enemy is probably going to be too weak by the time you get them to turn three. 184 damage, my gosh. And he's going to take quite a bit of damage too, I bet. Next time Oof comes out, he's going to heal us. That's a plus. Um, and the next turn we have is going to be a, a relatively, relatively tanky turn. Go Bros is going to come. Oh, nice. Go Bros will come out and they'll automatically get to do their active ability. Well, I, I, I'm almost dead to Topo. Topo. I don't feel like uh gave me this hard of a time when I played against him the first time. Alright, go bros. Do a lot of damage, please. I wish I had dupes of this guy too, so I could get some crits. I just brought my extreme uh, my extreme tech team here. Alright. We're gonna do this. And boom. Boom. Trying to make sure everyone gets a super attack here. Because we're going to have a rainbow key sphere changers. And again, I'm trying to make it to Oob. Oob is going to heal me. So. Yeah. <clears throat> I hope we don't take a super attack at all this time. Because I think we're going to die if... Uh, if Armor Trunks takes a super attack, I think we die. So... I should invest orbs into him because I like the unit. We would have done more damage if there we go. We would have done more damage if these guys had more super attack. All right, Boob is gonna fuse with Majin Boo. We got Super Maju or whatever his name is. No. We get to see a really, a really cool, really colorful super attack from LR Oob that does no damage. Feels bad. But that heal, that heal saved our butts. Alright, maybe Tapion will crit right here. Crit? Yes. Alright, if we don't take a super attack here, I expect a, a super attack uh, right away next turn. 210,000! Nice! 88,000! Not nice! Does, is there any bonus for him getting Rainbow Key Spheres? Attack plus set, okay. over here then give him more damage all right this is the turn with massive damage this is probably the tankiest rotation we have but with god goku that could potentially take the most damage i thought about transforming with trunks but at the same time there were too many rainbow key spheres on the field and his attack and his attack would be based off of how much key sphere he got I don't remember if he raises defense in the passive too when he grabs key spheres. Alright. We're at the do or die phase. Um Not sure how I wanna do how to do this. Ah oh, dang. Try to plan for a, a next turn to happen. Now that Tech Tapion isn't super attacking, that's that's extremely bad. But hopefully Vegeta gets a crit right here. He's got dupes in him. No. Oh. Gary. Once again, if this Trunks takes a super attack, I think we die and have to start over. And I really don't want to do that. Oh, no. Please take like 50,000 damage. 85. Super. Six. Six. Oh, my gosh. All right, we can't get super attacked right away or we'd lose. Yeah, 
We gotta get to those tech orbs. Trunks needs to heal me. Heal us, Trunks! <laughs> heal us, Oob! Alright, we're out of here. My goodness. Oh! <laughs> uh, I need to reevaluate my super team, my super tech team. Well, that was very uh, scary. Yeah, the first time I went through this, Jiren was the only one that gave me a problem. Uh, I, I flew through this fight. Same team. Um, not this time. It's like, nah. Nah, bro. Alright, physical super. Um, what are my leads? Leader? Six, two, four, five, six, seven. Okay. So this go- I brought in free-to-play future Gohan. I like him. He needs to be supported, though. Like he needs a support unit on his rotation for him to for him to be really good. We'll get to test that out here in a moment. All right, we're gonna do this. We can't seal him, I don't believe. Right? Yeah, we can't. All right, we're just gonna let everyone get a super attack. I wonder what Go Tanks is gonna be like. He's getting a seventy percent buff to his defense because of Kawasu Zamasu. Um, I've never used Gawasu Zamasu. I've had him for a long time. I just forgot that I had him and just now awakened him when I was going through my box. I'm like, oh, these guys. Well, let me use them. Very good unit. Has a chance to dodge. Can seal attack. And is a key and defensive types, uh, key and defensive support unit for the team. So that's really nice. Um, I'm curious what kind of damage Gotenks is going to take. 12,000, 12,000. Nice. Where he would have probably taken like 20,000. He's taking like almost 10,000 less. Alright, and then LR Great Sam and 1 and 2. Very good unit. I like him a lot. Let's see what kind of support. 48,000 defense. So, on the, the first time I came through, he was grouped up with... Uh... Kawasu Zamasu. So he had more defense. He had like 53 or 58,000. Um, and he still took quite a bit of damage. Uh, but I never got to see him attack. That was I seen that defense after that. So before that, he had no defense above. He took a lot. Now he has a defense above. He greatly... Nice. Double digits. With a 50% increase to his defense from Great Saiyan Man 1 and 2. Very solid unit, guys. Uh, free to play LR. Comes out of the uh, Friend Summon banner. One of the best, one of the best LRs free to play you could get. Um, I approve of him. All right, uh, we won't change the rotation. We'll just let. Hopefully, we'll just counter this dude to death. And they don't need the super attack. Counter. Ritz. All right, he. We should dispo should be dead one of these turns. I got dispo too. I've never really got to use him. I wonder when they're gonna come out with a either a pride trooper leader or a universe two a universe two leader all right what's up with this guy he gave me a tough time last time why oh because i didn't have a really good linking team all right i bring in i like to bring in we uh weirus and beast is what i was gonna say i'm tired i'm like 12 hours uh, I, I just, I streamed an 11 hour stream and then I failed this an hour ago and now, you know, we're two hours into this. So, alright, um, how do I want to do this? I think we're going to do this. Going to lower defense, going to grab all of this. Um, it's going to be a whole extra turn before, uh. LR Beerus shows up, so we won't save all that key for him. All right, lowers the defense. Immediately heals. That's cool, because he would have taken a lot of damage. Perfect. Super attacks the tank of the game. Like, one of the greatest tanks in the game. As far as Super Saiyans, as far as Saiyans go, I think this is the tankiest Super Saiyan. Um, I think Tech Golden Frieza tanks better at this point. I'm not 100% on that because I don't have my 
Vegeta rainbowed. And how do we want to do this? We want to do this. Um. Grab. 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 Oh no, he needs. Oh, he needs the ultra super attack. He should still be fine, but. Whoops. He's linked. Oh my god, Goku. You <laughs> so, so much damage. Uh, the original Super Saiyan 4s, Goku and Vegeta, were my first units I got in this game. Like, my first leaders. And they've carried me through this game. Like, all the way through everything. I just used them everywhere I possibly could. And then when I got Evil Vegeta, the pure Saiyan leader, he carried me the rest of the way. I was like, boom, now I, now, now I put these guys on the same team and it's over. <laughs> Never looked back. All right, perfect. They're going to get attacked first. Okay, not perfect. They can't get attacked first because that's too much damage. Um, We're going to go like this. We're going to go like this. Then we're going to go like this. And then we're going to go like this. And then we're going to go like this. Do, do. That's the X-Men theme song. All right. Hopefully we get normal attack first before we get super attacked. Yes. That's 20,000, 5,000. Like, their defense... Oh, that's so good. And then Vegeta, yep, the tank. Perfect. Then we got the Super Saiyan 4s here. Oh, that's an easy choice. Who am I going to have in slot number one is the question. Super Saiyan 4 Goku or Vegeta? Vegeta? Vegeta probably has more defense straight up. Goku needs a super attack to raise his defense more. Once he does super attack, he's fine. Yeah, Vegeta. All right. And Vegeta's just going to come through and just... He should finish him, even if Boo heals. Does he heal here? I don't see a healing icon anywhere. Nope, and he's not super attacking. It's... Oh, finish him. Oh, yeah. All right, and then AGL, super. Pretty straightforward, simple. I just bring LR Goku, LR Gohan, boom, 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 boom. Guys, if you're enjoying the video, let me know with a thumbs up. And if you if you have a hard time in Ultimate Clash, maybe you're new, maybe you don't have a bunch of really great units or categories, let me know because in the future Ultimate Clashes, I can always run uh, like 120% leaders or less. That way that, you know, and then just try to put units in there that probably just not over the top, just dominating as units. Just to kind of show you guys, uh, you know, different options available in case you don't have the best choices, right? Not everyone has rainbow units and not everyone, you know, can get all the good units from all the banners, right? So if you ever want me to use an unconventional team, I know there's, you know, there's people out there that use just free-to-play teams, right? But you want to mix and match those to the best of your ability. Uh, I'm not going to say I'm your guy, but I can definitely use, you know, showcase uh, other units in my teams or just use other units period and that's what i try to do every time i get new units and a new ultimate clash rolls around i just try to put in different units and throw them in there and see how well they do um the only new unit i'm i'm not going to get to use here uh is the new transforming gohan into great saiyan because half part of his passive comes from him fighting an extreme class enemy and jiren's the last guy and i Jiren's not an extreme class enemy, so the only reason I didn't use him because I I lost to Jiren and I had him there. He lowers attack, which would be good against Jiren, but my team gets destroyed before then, so I had to revise my team a little bit. I picked a slightly better leader for some of the team, and then I have like a 120% leader, so... It's definitely not good overall.
In fact, the more I think about it, the less... <laughs> the less sure I am about beating Jiren right here. Alright. I will beat him, though. It it'll happen. And once I beat him the first time, I'll beat him every other time after that. I meant to revise my extreme int team, too, because there was one unit in there that doesn't get, like, the full buff for the leader skill. And that was Super Vegeta. So I was like, man... I meant to switch him out, but I usually run Resurrected Warrior and Cell as a leader. And Cell is just a 120% leader. Vegeta gets, a, Vegeta gets a bonus as a defense, right? So he's at 170%, and then over here he's only getting the 50%. So that's, you know, 220%. Uh, and then we just fill it in here. Now, things that need to happen. Um, the Cells, the uh, Metal Coolers, they need to be... Uh, metal coolers need to be linked up and they're not going to be that really sucks and my tankiest turn is not here who's got more defense bojack who's gonna get more defense Twenty thousand off of attack one that's gonna be 87 we're gonna take a small chance I need I need Kid Buu to super tech because he's gonna heal me a little bit. If we take a massive amount of damage here, all right, good. He got okay. A normal attack first. That's lucky. Um, apparently that wasn't enough defense because he still he went from twenty five thousand damage to twenty two thousand damage. My God. But we're hoping for additional supers. That's why I wanted him to take the attack first. There we go. Perfect. So at least we got some decent damage in, I guess. Uh, Bojack's just a 55% or not even I don't I don't remember if I put super attack into him So uh, It looks like I did Oh, was that 2.1 million that was insane right, And he wow we didn't get super attack at all and he's gonna heal up some um All right, who's lowers attack? Greatly lowers defense you lower attack, don't you? No, it lowers defense. Is passive lowers attack? Ah. I could go like this. And we're going to go like that. There's no question. Unfortunately, the only super attack we're getting is going to be cell. I mean, that's not bad, but and boom, there we go. That's horrible. To get super attacked right away and get your defense lowered that greatly. Uh, yeah. If I'm extremely lucky, and I mean extremely lucky, um, Metal Cooler doesn't take a lot of damage here. He's gonna get attacked twice, though. I think he takes a lot of damage. And we weren't able to lower this guy's super attack at all. Oh man. Alright. We <laughs> We can't take a super attack. That cooler I don't think can be in the middle. Everyone's getting a defensive buff. Um this has to be the rotation, I think. I think. Maybe this is the rotation. Alright. Maybe this is the rotation. Um Boom, there we go. All right? Uh, I mean, I want Vegeta to get all that, but at the same time, I want the key spheres to actually line up relatively well. I'm hoping LR Cell comes out. So I'm hoping we don't get super attacked here. We take just a bunch of normal attacks. And we get a low enough health that Cell transforms. Um, oh. Oh, bucko. Dang. Oh, we, we're not playing this song. Dang it, Percy. Gotta remember to skip that in the future. I don't think we have enough life here, do we? No. But Cheetah's gonna take 20,000 a pop, so he's dead on hit number one. Hoping for a super attack, just... Nope. 16,000. Okay, with the with the buff. Alright, so he's half dead. Can we get this? Did I build my, t my super tech team? So... I forgot what I was running the first time because it's been so long, but I went ahead and I'm going to bring uh, GT Trio as leader number one. 
And then leader number two is just a 120% lead. And then this guy falls under the GT trio lead. And that's it. <laughs> and then everyone else is just out there to do their job. So if if we're going to take a lot of damage, hopefully UI Goku's on uh, turn two because he'll come out as UI Goku. He is. Okay, if we're going to take a lot of damage, that's going to be good. Um, let me let me look up this guy. What, what are we doing with him? Only five super attack. I'm dead. And oh, two. He's got two. Plus an additional attack boost and an additional defense boost by 15 with less HP. The greater E plus one and attack plus 10% at the start of each turn. Before. Okay. He stays on rotation because he's getting stronger. All right. So I think this is the rotation is what it's looking like. Um, Super attack. Super attack. And good luck, Goku. <laughs> Uh, Alright, so we're just hoping we don't take massive amounts of damage. 12, 12, and massive amounts of damage. Okay, lucky for us. Again, I think if we go below 50% HP with that one normal attack on Goku at the end, we're going to get... Yeah, we're going to get UI Goku right away, so hopefully he does a lot of dodging there. Relying on UI Goku, what is what does this game come down to? <laughs> what is what is Dokkan anymore? <laughs> oh, and you <laughs> look at all that rainbow key. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Let's calculate. Raise attack and defense for one turn. On um, attack and defense plus thirty percent per rainbow key sphere obtained. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, sorry, four. Like, is that enough? It's gotta be enough. <laughs> We're gonna lower his attack, but I don't know if I put UI Goku first and do it like this or not. We're gonna we're gonna rely on the dodge, and that's probably like the, the worst thing to do, but we're gonna do it. Here we go. I don't know what kind of defense Gotenks is going to get, but we're just hoping UI Goku. Come on. Like, this is canon right here. You dodge. You dodge these, Goku. Because if he gets super attacked or normal attack, he's probably going to get us killed. Oh, my God. He got hit. Please, no more. Oh, thank goodness. He dodged the super. All right. We're going to lower the attack for the first time. Get Goku is going to get his uh, passive. Uh, so he's going to emit. He's going to auto crit. And then it just depends on how much damage this guy takes with a small chance to dodge. 13,000. That's not bad. Um, I'm glad I didn't have him take the attacks though in the beginning because we probably would be worse off for damage. Alright. 126,000. 126,000. Doesn't matter where he goes. Okay, boom. Kid Goku. Take us home, baby. I expect like 2 million or more damage. And I am... With a level five super attack. <laughs> what a oh, I expect a lot. <laughs> I just for, I just remembered. Oh please! Oh my god, dude, that's level five super attack. That's insane. All right, thirty-four thousand. Everyone, okay, look here, BT trio, you got to, got to go. All right, Kid Goku, I believe, is still gonna have crits under his belt. Um, if Jiren isn't dead, something's wrong. So, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Hit that thumbs up if you did, please. It helps me out on the channel. And let me know how you did. If you need a little help, you can always reach out to me. Um, maybe we can come up with a team together. This is probably one of the toughest Jirens you'll see. Um, also, once again, link in the description below for the summoning video if you want to watch my dual Dogon Pass summons. I thought I had pretty hype summons. I was super excited. And face reveal. Ooh, you can see my stupid face where I do a stupid dance with an off sync camera because I haven't used it in like three, four, five months. So it was completely off sync. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, and uh, description in the link below for the music as well. Let's go take a look at the Baba Shop real quick because I'm just curious how much battlefield points we got. And I'm going to bed. Um, 
could be close to a million. 972,000. So, yeah, I think I'm going to get another Mecha Frieza King Cold. I want to get more oops as well. I do want another cooler. Um, which probably wouldn't be a bad choice to get if you're you're hurting on this event and you really want to beat Cheering. Slowly rainbow your cooler. Like, once every other battlefield would be probably fine to just build up your uh, battlefield memory, I would say, because he, he doesn't cost a lot, and he's a pretty solid unit. He's a pretty solid unit. Um, Once again, thank you all for watching. Super appreciate it, and have yourselves a wonderful day. We'll see you next time. Uh, if you don't see this video Sunday, we will see you this video Tuesday. If you see this video Sunday or Monday, you'll see another video Tuesday with one of the legendary Goku event missions. And we'll have weekly Dokkan content on my channel every Tuesday. Thank you for watching. Once again, good night.